When a high-profile athlete is taken down by a torn meniscus, it makes news. It makes many people believe it's primarily jocks who suffer this injury. That's just not the case. It's extremely common and happens to, to almost patients of any age. We'll see it in uh, uh, children, you know, as young as six, seven, eight sometimes, but even older patients up to, you know, 80s and 90s. The meniscus is a cushion of cartilage in the knee that provides padding and stability. It can tear as a result of an injury from twisting or a sudden stop. Sometimes patients will feel a pop. Oftentimes they can tell you where it hurts with one finger pointing to one side or the other of the knee. Uh, it's often associated with a lot of swelling and a lot of popping and clicking. Other times tears can result from chronic degeneration. So older people can experience a meniscus tear just from doing everyday activities, especially if they're overweight. Studies found the elderly may not experience pain from minor tears, meaning they don't always need surgery. We treat it without surgery if the tears are small. Uh, but a lot of times we have to do what's called an arthroscopy where we go in through the small incisions with the camera and most of the time if the tear is not too big we just take out the part that's torn. Depending on the size and location, surgeons may be able to repair the cartilage. We're sewing the, the torn meniscus back to the capsule or the wall inside of the knee and leaving it still long enough for it to heal. From simple sutures uh, to some devices that have basically like little cufflinks that we poke through the, the capsule. Mending the tattered knee is a common and reliable procedure, one that can help people get back up and moving. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.